Hello and welcome to this TechnicForce tutorial. In this video, we're going to look at how to translate voiceover into voiceover of another language. In previous tutorials, we took a look at Linguascribe's text-to-speech, speech-to-text, and translate text functions, and how for each of these functions you had to input your originating and outgoing language and service provider for each one, and then to repeat the process for every language that you wanted to output to. We also briefly mentioned how you could combine these various functions to convert, for example, an English audio into text, translate that text into a foreign language, and then convert that foreign text into speech in a different language, and then repeat that process for every output language that you want to achieve. Well, Linguascribe makes it so much easier with the jobs function. Here, we can set up as many different languages as we want, and we can create a jobs chain. And this chain will act as a template that will take our audio source file, in this case English, convert this English voiceover file into English text, translate the English text into Arabic, and then convert the Arabic text into Arabic voiceover, and then repeat the process again for Spanish. Once you have this template saved, you can change your source file again and again and get all the outputs you need with just a couple of easy clicks. Let's see how. From the Home tab, you can see all of your various jobs that you've completed, as well as how many times you've run each job. And every time you run the job, it's called a gig. That's the specific input file that you applied to each job template. So to start with, we got to create the template. So let's go to Jobs to do that, and then add a job. In this case, we'll give the job a descriptive title. We'll call it Audio Convert. And what do we have to convert? We have a text file or an audio file. In this case, we're going to be converting an English voiceover file. So we have the audio and add job. And here is our audio convert job added to the chart. And to see the details, we can just view job under the actions column. And here is our blank template. Each template can have a variety of tasks and each task will have a variety of actions. So let's start by adding a task. And we'll give this task a name. We'll call this one Arabic. And next, and that is our new task. To add an action to this task, we can click the green plus button here that says add action. And now we want to convert our English speech to text. So let's click here to do that. And we can choose Google, Amazon, or Microsoft as our service provider. We use Amazon for this example. And what language is the audio in? So our voiceover file is in English. So let's add that as an action. So we've added an action now, speech to text. This will convert our English voiceover file that we'll input. And right now this is blank because it's just a template, but it'll convert that English file into English text. So now we'll add another action and we'll translate that text into another language. So again, we have our choice of service providers and the language that the text is in currently is in English, but the language we want to translate to is Arabic and add that as an action. And now we have a translate action. So our English voiceover gets translated to text, gets translated to Arabic. And now we got to add one more action to convert this Arabic text to Arabic speech. So again, we have our choice of service providers. And what language is the text in? It is currently in Arabic and we can choose a voice and add that action. And that completes our chain. So our originating voice file will be converted to English text and then translated to Arabic and then converted to speech. So let's do that again. We'll add another task and we'll call this task Spanish next. And we can add as many tasks here as we want. So in addition to Arabic and Spanish, we might also want to have Chinese and Hindi. And that would vastly multiply the size of the audience that we're able to reach with our marketing campaigns. But for now, we'll just focus on Spanish. We'll add an action. We're going to convert our English audio into English text. So our originating language is English US. We'll add an action. So now that we have the audio converted into English text. Now we can 
translate that into another language, choose our service provider. The text is currently in English, and we want to translate that to Spanish. Add that as an action. So now we have our Spanish text, and now we are going to add one more action to convert the Spanish text to Spanish speech. Click here, choose a service provider. The text is currently in Spanish. And we'll select a voice and add that as an action. And that completes this chain. And if we wanted to add any more tasks to our chain, we can, but for now, for this tutorial, I think that's enough. So in order to activate our chain, we have to input the audio file, but this is just a template. We don't input the audio file here. To do that, we go to the gigs tab here under gigs and we add a gig and we'll call this gig name convert audio Arabic and Spanish. And which job is this gig for? Here from the dropdown, we see a list of all of our jobs. And here is the audio convert template that we just set up under jobs. So let's select that one and go next. Now we finally get to input our audio file. So we just click here to choose the file from our system. And because we instructed our job template that we'd be inputting an English audio file, be sure that the audio file you input is English. If you start this chain by inputting a language other than English, it's going to mess the whole chain up. So this is an English file. So we'll go ahead and input this one and then add the gig. And that's it. Our gigs chart has been updated to show our new audio convert Arabic and Spanish job is pending. And to view the details of it, all we have to do is just click view gig. And everything here is automatic. All we have to do is wait. We can see that the first step is the speech to text conversion. And that has been queued for both languages simultaneously. If we go back to the gigs homepage, we can see that our status has now been updated from pending to ongoing. And we can just keep an eye on the actions of it by looking at the view gig button. Now each of these steps is going to take a minute to complete. So I'll just pause here for a moment and then we'll refresh the page. And you can see that our conversion of speech to text has been completed and that the next step of translate is now ready to submit. And again, this takes a minute just to go through the system. So I'll just pause for a moment and then I'll refresh the page. And now the translation has taken place. So the English voiceover has now been converted to text, which has now been translated to Arabic and Spanish. And now the next step of the chain is ready to submit. And again, this takes about a minute to go through the system. So I'll just pause for a moment and then I'll click refresh. And our conversion from text to speech is now completed. So the complete chain is now finished for both Arabic and Spanish. And we can download each of the individual files for every step of the way. So if we want to download the English transcription of our voiceover, we can click here to download that as a text file. If we want to download the Arabic translation of that text file, we can click here to download that as a text file. And if we want to download the Arabic voiceover, we can click the download button and it will open in a new tab in our browser from where we can save it. And I'll just preview the Arabic text here. And Perfect. So to save the file, I'll just click Control S to save this to my downloads folder. And we'll save that. And now I'll go back to Linguascribe. And we'll do the same thing for Spanish. I'll download the English transcription. And this should be a duplicate of this step here, actually, because it's the same voiceover file that got transcribed both times. But here I'll download the Spanish translation of the text. 
And here we'll preview the Spanish voiceover. Aplicafor se complace en anunciar Linguist Scribe, la aplicación de traducción multilingüe más avanzada de hoy con la capacidad de traducir, transcribir o expresar rápidamente en 100 idiomas más diferentes. Uso de la tecnología de IA. Es increíble y su primera opción para la localización de contenido consíguelo el 15 de noviembre 20. So let's go ahead and save that voiceover file and saved. And that's how easy it is to translate English voiceover into voiceover in over a hundred different languages with Linguascribe. I hope you found this tutorial useful. Thanks very much for watching.